I got the footage from the security camera here. Let's 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 see exactly what went down here. Fair warning on this video. If you don't like hearing babies cry, probably really not gonna like this video. So if you keep watching from here on and you have a problem with babies crying, it's your own fault. Your own fault! Not mine! Don't blame me if you keep watching! <laughs> Now seriously though, I'm, I'm used to hearing babies cry, so it's not that bad for me. Uh, even though it's my own daughter. I've already watched the video back like three or four times. Just to make myself feel bad for being a dummy. It's alright though, we're good. Huh, are we good? Are we good? Are we still friends? Can I have a smooch? Um... Ah. Uh, no. ah. <laughs> yep, she got bit in the face, man. But how you doing, T? You okay? You all right? First of all, can we check? Can we take a look at her awesome outfit? Daddy dressed her. What you got going on here, T? Let's see you. Let's see you. Oh, that's a nice dress. Oh, the dresses are so nice. And then we got. Hey. Oh, what she picked out? Did you pick those boots out, T? Are those your favorite boots? Yeah. Let's take a look at that lip. Let's have a look, T. You stand over here. Let's have a close look there. Yeah, right. Oh, look up here, T. Right there. Poor little lip. Little lippy. Oh, he's me. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Anyway, yeah, I just kind of wanted to share the experience with you guys because, A, <laughs> <with A, laughs> Hey, I felt pretty bad. I still feel bad. In fact, I, we got we got the footage of it happening on one of the security cameras. Unfortunately, um, something was blocking the camera, so we didn't actually see the thing. But I wouldn't. I don't actually want to show like the exact thing anyway. But <clears throat> what I did want to share was what I took from it, and what I think that lots of other people could take from it, which is why we're talking about it. And and, <laughs> and what she took from it. Just there were two main things. Baba that I think we really took from it that I think other people will benefit from as well. And then one main thing, the one thing that I take from it mostly is that I'm far from perfect. It, let, me, let, me, let me lay down, let me lay down for you guys what exactly happened. Come here, T. Hillary's out having a mommy night with one of her friends and the boys are going to sleep, getting tired. She's getting tired, everybody's tired. Uh, she didn't want to go to sleep though. So her brothers go to sleep. We come down here, I got snake stuff to do, we're hanging out. I accidentally I accidentally bap her in the back of the head with the snake hook while she's down there on the ground and I'm working on stuff. And she, So she got a little upset from that, she's crying. And I was like, dang it! I'm feeling like an idiot already, of course, for bapping my daughter in the head with a snake hook. And then uh, she's crying, I calm her down a little bit. And, and then... I was like, I'm a distractor. Oh, we're gonna feed snakes. Look, we're feeding snakes. It's cool. And she stops crying. She's like, oh, we're gonna feed snakes. And then there's one of these ones up here that's just like right about this this height. You know, and I can't really quite see over the lip and I'm just holding her and I went to go pull it open. I'm going to feed the snake. And just comes out and grabs her on the freaking lip. Right there. Like she had just stopped crying about the snake hook thing like 10 seconds beforehand. And then bam! I mean, I got the footage from the security camera here. Let's, let's, let's see exactly what went down here. So there she's crying. Crying because I just bapped her in the face with the snake hook. Not in the face, sorry, in the head. And she's crying because I just bapped her in the head with the snake hook. And I was like, check this out. Check this out. We're going to feed some snakes. You okay? And immediately she's like, oh, okay. We're going to feed snakes? Cool. Let's do that. Let me go over here. And pull open the tub. I'm like, where's the snake at? Can't quite see it. Let's go. I want her to be able to see. And she's like, oh, let's look. And then bam, it grabs her on the face. I take the snake off of her, put it back in the tub. <sighs> oh man, I've been watching this footage back again and again. So here's, here's the lessons we learned from that. A, my daughter's a badass, because immediately after I got the, you know, you got anybody who's bit by a non-venomous snake knows it's really not that big a deal. I mean, even on the lip. <laughs> The important thing was I asked her afterwards if she wanted to hold a snake after she stopped crying and she said yes. So she's badass. That's the first thing I wanted to express. <laughs> what are you doing, Goofy Boofy? What's
What's this place? Second of all, if, if it had been a, a pet dog or a pet cat that grabbed her on the face, it would have been way more serious. That's one thing. That's the main point I want. That's the main point I want to get across in this video is that having a bite from a snake is so much less serious than something like a dog or a cat. When people have pet dogs and pet cats, the potential for a bite on the face from one of them is might be looking at a hospital trip. Whereas with her, we just dab it up with a little paper towel. And then she's good. You want to hold the snakey? You want to hold the snake that bit you? Yeah? So it was actually this little scaleless head, pastel, lemon pastel, uh, clown female that got her in that fiend response. It wasn't her fault. It was all our fault, you know. Huh. You like that snakey? This is snake that bit your face. Is that okay? Yeah. That's okay, huh? You want to hold her? Yeah? There you go. <laughs> That's an awesome snake. You done? You all done? Okay, that was quick. At least she held it. So the two important lessons here today. If you fall off the horse, get right back on it. That goes for everybody. Or if you get bit by the snake, pick it back up. As long as it's non-venomous. And snake bites aren't that serious. Oh, uh, look at that, T. And I guess lessons three and four behind that are Brian's kind of a dummy, but his daughter's a badass. Yeah. Are we going to hold? <laughs> <laughs> Hillary's home from her spa day. How was the spa day? So good. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I got to um, go Does swim. Swim and hang out by the pool and read my book and then Run some errands do some shopping Mommy? You didn't get beat by any children while you were there? Mommy? No, mommy. there were no children around me the whole time Hold your horses. You had mommy for this whole car ride. It's my turn for mommy. I just want to know How you feel about your daughter getting bit in the face by a snake as somebody who grew up with Mm -hmm. Fear, nightmares about snakes, worms. I mean, it honestly. Hey, crazy! I kind of knew it was coming. I mean, just because every time she's down here, she's holding a snake, and I just knew it would happen eventually. Doesn't yeah. mean I feel okay about it. I'm glad it was just a little one and didn't really hurt her, but I think that I don't want it to happen again. Well, why not? <laughs> how are we gonna How are we gonna do that, honey? Oh, yeah, what? I'd like I'd like to know what you learned from this experience. <laughs> well, yeah. I already talked about what I learned, so you oh. missed it. <laughs> if you guys watched the last video, if you missed the last video, you should go back and watch it because I think it has a very important message in it that a lot of people need to hear. But we're about to film. I haven't I haven't seen that video yet because obviously, if you I haven't put that video up yet so I'm because I'm still filming the b-roll for the ending segment for it. we're about to film it right now it's gonna be people getting crazy which uh, is definitely happening in here but mm, I know this is a short little video but I was basically you know, one of the things I'm trying to do with the videos now is make sure that every single video has a, a specific point and unless I have a specific point to share I won't make a video so if you missed the point is the point is that stakes are safer than cats and dogs <laughs> hey Noah Okay. What do you yeah, know? I know. Rainbow. What about rainbows? That the only kind of ra the only rainbow, double rainbow I see had a rainbow that I could totally see and one that I could barely see. Down up in Livermore. And really cool. And rainbows are always red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple. Unless you draw a rainbow. And that's all I know. All right, Eli, since you can't be quiet for Noah's turn, what do you know? I know. Poop. <laughs> what about? Poop. Daddy's stinky and that's all I know. <laughs>
And that's what led me to this. Like, I came back from Canada. I started scrolling down Facebook a little bit. I was like, oh, man. And then I scrolled a little bit more. I was like, oh, man. 